coming, you kind of get your name out there in front of these Diamond League races and big international races. Um, what's it like to do it, to win the uh, um, it's great. I think I first, my mom noticed that people actually say my last name right now, so I think that's a good sign that people know who I am. Um, but yeah, it feels great. It's um, it's something I've wanted for so long, and I haven't done that well at championships, and I was really nervous coming in. I've had a few races where I just, I haven't felt good, I've been sick or something, but um, for all the training I've done, I know that I can feel terrible and still come out on top, so just having that confidence, um, I just knew that if I race smart today, I could come away with it. Were you confident that you could reel her back in? Yeah, um, you know, I, I, my coach and I talked. Like, I didn't want to be in second place because um, if there was going to be a move, I didn't want to get boxed in by someone coming around behind me. So I tried to stay in third as much as I could. But knowing where Kristen was ahead of me, and when I heard the bell lap, I just my legs felt good, and I knew that if I just worked on her slowly, that I could could reel her in. Were you surprised that it went out so fast? No. Um, Kristen's always so strong. Um, I know that's how she likes to race. And honestly, I would have been really surprised if it would have been anything different. Is it the necklace? I think so. You know, I got a new hairstyle and necklace. So sometimes I wear the necklace and sometimes I don't. But I think it's, uh, it's got a good, good luck streak going. Is that special? It feels great. Um, it's very bittersweet because I'm not here with my teammate Anna Pierce, who um, my training partner, one of my best friends, and we trained our asses off this whole year to be here together. And I'm really sorry for her that it didn't work out, but I know she's happy for me, and we'll still have a good season. Has she been healthy all spring? Um, she, you know, has a little bit of issues during the fall, so she did have to miss some time, and she's been coming back fine, but just isn't a hundred percent sharp yet. But by the end of the year, I'm sure she'll be. She'll have that kick again, and she'll be back to where she is. Any thoughts to Europe and Worlds and going, trying to go sub four? Um, yeah, I think sub four is you know the next goal. Um, I'm actually heading to Europe tomorrow. My, I'm going to race Lausanne on June 30th. It'll be a 1500, and hopefully back there with Jamal and Berka, and that should be a fast race. So I'm really looking forward to running sub four as soon as possible. Good job. Thank you.